extreme. The race to recall Governor Gavin Newsom. Today, one of his best-known opponents is offering up a challenge to the governor. Eyewitness News reporter Josh Haskell says all this as the official list of candidates has just been revealed. The recall election is less than two months away, and 41 candidates will appear on the ballot to replace California Governor Gavin Newsom. Republican candidate Kevin Faulkner wants to debate Newsom, but tells Eyewitness News he's not holding his breath. I'm absolutely challenging Gavin Newsom to stand up and try to defend his record. I'm happy to stand up uh, and defend mine. And I think that's the debate that Californians expect. I think that's one that they deserve. Again, we had two million Californians that signed this recall petition. This recall is happening, and I think that they want that debate, and they want to hear about these competition of ideas. Loyola Law School professor Jessica Levinson believes Newsom is taking the recall effort seriously, but isn't too concerned about those running against him. We don't have a big marquee name in this list, and the date of the recall, I also think that helps the governor. Biggest question for the governor will probably be how the COVID numbers are doing and how his base is feeling, whether or not his base shows up or if they feel apathetic. Newsom's biggest concern about the recall might be whether his base will show up, which is why he fought in court and lost in order to be listed as a Democrat on the ballot. The governor was in Sonoma County Monday addressing the homeless crisis and was asked whether all the money the state is spending could be a magnet for the unhoused to come to California. To the extent that um, people want to come here for new beginnings at all income levels, that's part of the California dream. And we have a responsibility to accommodate uh, and enliven and inspire. And California's dream is still alive and well. Faulkner jumped on this following our interview, tweeting, This is crazy. I have incredible compassion for homeless Californians. But no, we should not be encouraging homeless people from other parts of the country to move to California. In Los Angeles, Josh Haskell, ABC 7 Eyewitness News.